Hey everybody, it's Jamie the Crafty DIY Guy. Welcome to my channel. I got a friend with me today. Hi. <laughs> Hey everybody, in today's video, I am in Los Angeles, California, and we are going to be doing a haul from the 99 cent store, 99 cent only store. Now, if you're not familiar with the 99 cent only store, um, it's it's a little misleading. Not everything in the store is 99 cents. Um, everything is a various price. I think they originally started off as a 99 cent store and then they just started to grow and started to add more things. And, um, you know, that is uh, sometimes the fun in it because the store actually has a lot of really cool decor stuff. And I picked up a lot of really fun goodies. And what's great about 99 cent only stores is that they have these great bags that are reusable. So I purchased these as well. Um, I want to introduce you to my friend, Kwajalein, because you guys are probably wondering who she is. <laughs> um, her name is Kwajalein Brown. She is an actress. And if you're not, if you're familiar with shows like Cobra Kai, House of Cards, help me out here. Uh, Drop Dead Diva. Drop Dead Diva. She's done a ton of work and you can look her up on IMDb. It's Kwajalein Brown and I'll have her information down here at the bottom of the video so you can check her out. But we're here in LA. We're um, doing some client stuff and just hanging out and I'm here for my, my day job. And uh, I thought that it would be fun to just include Kwajalein because she's never been to a 99 cent only store either. So she's gonna also see some of this stuff for the first time. So before I get into that deal, I have to say thank you to my subscribers. You guys know who you are. My OGs, everybody in between. Thank you guys so, so much for being here. I truly appreciate you. If you're brand new to the channel, maybe even YouTube recommended this video to you. Thank you, YouTube. And uh, hopefully you will subscribe and stick around. All right, let's jump into the haul. It's a little chilly here in uh, Los Angeles, like 63 degrees in, in the evening. All right, so the first bag I grabbed, you guys know me, so you know I'm gonna grab some socks. Right. And I always like, and I like these little ankle socks, especially for like the summertime and everything. Uh, how much do you think these were? Ooh. Let's play this game. Oh gosh. How much um, do you think these were? $2? You were right, $1.99, $1.99. Ah, and I got six pairs of socks. Oh, wow, that's For $1.99, so six pairs of socks, $1.99, wow. and uh, you know, some great colors and things, and they, I was scared for a minute, they are men's, <laughs> and so, but, you know, that doesn't bother me. So, um, the next thing I grabbed was a pair of flip-flops, oh, yeah. some cute little camo flip-flops, perfect for the pool you know, hanging out. Um, Miss Quadula, how much do you think these were? Okay, maybe a dollar for those. Um, actually, I don't know because they don't have a price on the tag. Okay. But you know I will have my receipt because we always talk about fetch rewards and we'll get to that when I find the receipt. And try and keep me honest and let me... Okay. I think they were a dollar though. Okay. Um, the other thing I grabbed was this really cute galvanized oh. metal planter. Um, it's got the three buckets in it. It's in this cute little tray. You could easily upcycle this if you wanted to. You could also uh, keep it exactly how it is, which is probably what I'm going to do with it. Any guesses hmm. on the price? You may have seen it when I'm showing. No, I, I did. I looked away on purpose. Um, <laughs> let's see. Uh, $2.50. $2.50. Ah. It was a dollar ninety nine. What? So she's close. I was she's close, but dollar ninety nine. Super cute, right? Mm -hmm. Definitely got a farmhouse vibe to it. You could easily spray paint these, make them another color. What I loved about it is you've got three pots, plus you've got the great carrier at the bottom, so it's kind of perfect. That's adorable. I told you I'm gonna have problems with all this stuff in my suitcase <laughs> on the way back. Yeah. Um, I've got to have a snack. We're probably gonna eat these when we're done filming, but have some butter toffee peanuts. Ooh. And um, I don't even know how much those are. We will look at the receipt what the minute, is whenever we get to the receipt. <laughs> yeah, for sure. All right, um, I'm not gonna pull that out yet. Uh, this thing, little light up sign, it's the and sign, oh, super cute, right? Okay. And you know, it's a, the and sign, it's a hashtag sign. And um, it's battery operated. It's um, 
you know, just something I'm going to use it for propping, like in the background and stuff in my videos. But uh, any ideas? Okay, I will say that's a dollar fifty. Dollar fifty. So, uh, double that, so it's two ninety nine. Oh, okay. So three dollars. Hmm. Battery operated light. They actually had one in the store that was working, so I could see how bright it was, and it was actually pretty cool. Not bad. Um, and it's just something fun. They had it and side as well but it was white and i didn't want a white one mm. i wanted the black one so uh the other thing i grabbed i thought this was kind of cute so i'm traveling a lot now we're starting to travel more for work this is my first business trip since like covid i brought my friend along with me because she's back and forth between la and atlanta a lot here on productions and stuff so we're just kind of having a like a like a girls weekend <laughs> <laughs> hanging out and uh they had these hairspray pens. So oh. it's like small and convenient that you can carry like in your purse. It doesn't take up a full like, you know, yeah. bag in your, um, like a full bottle of hairspray or anything. And uh, it was $2.99. Wow. And you know, the Tresemme hairspray, I don't really like it, but it's, it's not bad in a pinch. And it has 15 plus sprays in this little thing so very nice not a bad mm -mm. not a bad thing uh the other thing i grabbed gotta wait on that um they had some really cool summer like nautical stuff oh, that's cool and they had um this i'm gonna hide the price tag right. so they had this great compass she already saw the price <laughs> but um super cute right it's metal mm. and again something that could be very easily painted uh, it was $2.99, so I thought that that was super cute and fun. And um, I have a compass that's on my front porch. Oh, which is why I so love. So I don't know what, maybe I'll put this one on the back porch. Um, this was fun. It's a little portable disco light. Ah, oh, I've been wanting to get one of those. It's a little portable disco <laughs> light, and you just, it, it takes batteries, and you set it on the table or something, and then it, like, gets, it, it probably doesn't light up the room, but it probably lights up, you know, the, the table. Yeah. I think it would be cute. That is cute. Um, any ideas? Mini LED disco light. Five dollars. Five dollars. Nope. Two ninety nine. Oh wow. You I'm can like have bet it. And zero. Oh, thank you. <laughs> oh, this is so cute. Uh the other thing I grabbed, you know, in that galvanized metal family, some super cute pots, planter stuff. Um, this, but it's actually two oh, pots. So I just nice. got to fix the chain on it because they just get a little, a little twisted. But, um, you know, it's like hanging pots for um, herbs or plants or flowers or anything. And the chain does straighten up here. Like this, you can see right here where it's a little yeah. twisted. Yeah. It and in the there it goes. Yeah. So it gets better when you play with it. There it goes. So super cute, and uh, any idea? I'm gonna go with two ninety nine. <laughs> two ninety nine. Nope. Dollar ninety nine. Uh -huh. It's a dollar ninety nine. And again, this is something really, really cute for the price. Mm -hmm. But you guys know you could easily make this with Dollar Tree because you could get the Dollar Tree plant hanger kit. You could get two of those. You could get two of these types of pots. But then you're spending already four dollars so you can just buy this for a dollar ninety nine perfect not a bad deal that will probably go out on the back deck in my house um so i have one thing down in this bag that i'm gonna save because i have something else that goes with it in another bag but that was super cute little oh, okay. anchor oh, oh, okay it lights up oh, how cute i love that um i don't have the price on it but um it's it's on the receipt so we'll look at that but you know something cute maybe for the bathroom or maybe even outside on the deck i thought that was cute all right so that is bag number one bag number two will go in because that includes something for this all right so they had these really cool decorative signs and they had this one that said we'll turn it this way that says <laughs> welcome nice and it's just wood Oh, you know, okay. Yeah. Wood ish. So, wherever it was from, from Floracraft, it was $6.99 regular price. That's not how much uh, 99 cent only was selling for. How much do you think it was? 
$1.99. And look, you can put it like on a wreath. Like there's some really cool. You're exactly right. $1.99. I got one. Finally. $1.99 for that one. So welcome sign. And then there was this one that says love. Aww. Which again is super cute. They show it here how you can put these on a wreath. $1.99 oh, nice. as well. And then this one that says blessed was also $1.99. They had these sizes and then they had the larger sizes. Regardless of which size you bought, they were all $1.99. So again, super, super cute. Um, so this, I freaked out at. Mm. Handheld sewing machine from Sunbeam. Perfect for like quick touch-ups, you need to hem something, maybe a pillow has like lost some stitching or something, or you're making a Dollar Tree pillow, and instead of using hot glue or something like that, you could easily do this. And the thing I was hiding was some thread, because I don't know if there's anything in here or not. So the thread, um, I don't see a price on, but how much do you think that was? Like, check that out, guys, that's crazy. Five. Exactly. Four ninety nine. I was off by a penny. I'm getting better. Four ninety nine, right? <laughs> yes. Really, really cool. Like as soon as I saw this, I was like, I really need this. And it takes four AA batteries, and it ha includes one extra needle and three extra bobbins. I don't even know what a bobbin is, but I'm gonna figure it out. <laughs> nice. Then I bought the thread because I thought that I might need that. This now. Quadulin lives in Atlanta with me most of the time. Mm -hmm. Not with me, but, you know, in Atlanta. And uh, although you have lived with me before. Yeah, <laughs> We were roommates at one time. And uh, uh, she knows I have my back porch, my back deck, and I love it. And uh, I bought this. It's an inflatable cooler. It is a flamingo, but look how tall it is. Oh, wow. It is 30 inches tall. It's almost three feet tall. And... You fill up the, I don't want to move my hand because you'll see it, but you fill up this part with ice and then you get your drinks in there. So it's it's 30 inches. It's almost three feet tall. Wow. That's pretty cool. Any idea uh, how much that was? Like, how cute is that, guys? Seriously. Uh, $4.99. $4.99. $5.99. Uh, so, like, how adorable is that? I love And that. I love flamingos. Yeah, because with your lights have, that you have. Yeah, <laughs> and I have flamingo lights already on the back porch, so that was super cute. Uh, all right, so you know the um, Jenga blocks, the uh, the faux Jenga blocks that Dollar Tree sells. Um, they are, you know, super useful. We do a lot of different projects with them. But they had this shot set that was a drinking game, but it's made with those tumbling tower blocks. And so I, I opened it up in the store because I wanted to see how big the blocks were. And um, the blocks are pretty good size, like that's three blocks. But what's cool about them is that they do have like things like when you draw out your Jenga block, mm -hmm. it's like you have to drink or everybody <laughs> drinks wine oh my God. or you know you lose your next turn. So it's, it's, it's supposed to be a drinking game. I'll use them for DIY projects though, because they're really good sized blocks. And then it does come with a couple shot glasses and like four shot glasses. So, you know, you can always kind of use those. But um, this was $5.99, I think, or $3.99. Oh, wow. $3.99. So again, you know, I'm gonna reuse these for DIY projects. But again, something that I thought was super, super cute and fun and easy to um, reuse, repurpose. All right, that is bag number two. Okay. So bag number three, I think you're gonna love one of these, okay. this particular thing. Let me see if I can hide the tag so she can't <laughs> see how much it is. Um, oh, vintage, it looks really, oh wow. It looks really vintage, it's a decanter. Yeah. And uh, the stopper on this one is really good. I made sure of it. Um, I think it's actually sealed, mm. so I won't try and break it off because I have to figure out how to get it home <laughs> to Atlanta from California. Good luck. But um, any any idea? Okay. So, you know, for my, I have a great bar at the house, and this is for 
bourbon or for scotch, you know, or something like this. And I have a, they had one like this, and then they had another one that was kind of a plaid um, look. And I have something that's kind of that plaid look now, so I wanted something that was a little different looking. But great, like I crystal decanter. It's yeah, beautiful, right? That's great. Any idea how much? I'm scared now. Uh, two ninety nine. Two ninety nine. Okay. You're gonna die. What? You're gonna want to go back and get one tomorrow. Okay. A <laughs> dollar ninety nine. You're kidding. It's a dollar ninety nine. Oh wow. And it is thirty five ounces. Oh wow, may I? Yeah. Oh, and that's gorgeous. Thirty, yeah, gonna like a dollar ninety nine for that. It's crazy. And they, they wrapped it in a paper towel for me. Very nice. So that was cute. Um, the other thing that they had were these uh, bamboo garden fences. So they're all like strung together and they're perfect for, um, you know, like oh. using as a border or something. And um, I have some, I have some little pesky birds yeah outside and i'm thinking that this might help keep them away i don't know but honestly i thought too that if i trim the points off i could even use the bamboo pieces for other projects mm -hmm. so um i thought that this would be really cool um i was i originally was gonna buy like five or six bundles of these and then i was like i don't really need that many and then i was like i'm gonna have problems getting them home <laughs> so um any idea 99 99 cents. Dollar ninety-nine. Well, that was one for Dollar ninety-nine, you know, not a bad deal. And then I've got um two more things, but before I do that, we've got the receipt. So I know there's a couple things we need to confirm prices on. But remember, if you're not um participating with fetch rewards, you're missing out on free money. Every time you go shopping, you take a receipt, you scan it into the app. When you scan your receipts, you earn points as a thank you. You can earn like 25 points, 50 points. It just depends on what you buy. But um, you can take those points once you've accum accumulated enough and you can turn those in for gift cards. I personally have got thousands of dollars, not many hundreds of dollars, in uh, Amazon gift cards. And uh, they have Visa gift cards, they have Target gift cards, they have Walmart gift cards. And literally every single receipt, gas station receipts, McDonald's receipts, it doesn't matter what it is. Mm -hmm. You scan it into the app, you earn points. If you're not a member already, in the description box below, there's a link. You can sign up for Fetch Rewards. And when you use my code, you'll automatically get 2,000 points that you can put towards your gift card. So remember to scan every receipt. All right, we had to find the anchor and I don't remember. Oh, the flip-flops. Okay, the full, um, I know you won't be able to see this. Don't tell the people I'm blind. <laughs> oh they know that I'm blind as well. So um, let's see, let's see. The, um, you know what, I, Okay, wait. I'm gonna. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna take All it. Right, she's gonna attempt it. So we've got two more things, and I thought that this again was super, super cute. Um, check out this tiered tray. Oh, that is super oh, cute. I love that. They had this pattern. They had like a uh, almost like a Moroccan pattern that was kind of cool, yeah. and then they had another one. This one I thought would be the easiest to DIY or to change, and it's got these great like kind of mid-century looking legs on it. But what I really liked about this, this circle you could easily redo, make it into something else. But these legs are all screwed on there with little tiny screws. Nice. You could easily just take these legs and use them for something else. This was $5.99. So it was probably a little pricey considering it's like press board. But I think the legs alone for this are totally worth it. And then the last thing I grabbed, was this cute home sweet home tray. Aww. And I, again, thought that this was super, super cute. It was $3.99. And again, something that was super, super adorable. 
and uh, you know we can use for a while or you can easily redo that as well. All right, guys, that is everything. Thank you so much. Remember to check the link below for Fetch Rewards and uh, let me know in the comments below what you thought of the 99 cent store and uh, tell me what your favorites were. All right, guys, and check out Kwajalein on IMDb. All right, guys, take care. Bye. Bye.